learning check related to ANP, which is a natriuretic peptide we talked about when we talked about blood pressure. So here it is again. Remember that ANP is produced by the cardiac myocytes due to high blood pressure. There are other types of natriuretic peptides. Um, this is the one we've seen before that it's produced by the atria itself. This is going to target three places, two of which are related to kidney function. One is inhibiting aldosterone release from the adrenal cortex. So high blood pressure is going to decrease aldosterone, thereby decreasing sodium reabsorption, thereby decreasing water reabsorption. And you already knew this, right? You totally remembered it. And now you understand even better this process, right? This piece here, right at the DCT. We've also talked about how A&P targets the kidney to increase salt, salt and water loss. Okay, now we can actually tell you that it does that by um, increasing okay, vasodilation of the afferent arteriole and vasoconstriction of our efferent arterial. This is going to do what to GFR? Increase it, right? Increased GFR is going to increase salt and water loss. So bringing it together, what you know before.